working in Blender 2.5 beta today. Uh, we're going to be looking at selecting all vertices connected to a sub-object, and I'll show you what I mean. I don't know if sub-object is the proper term, but here's our default scene. Uh, we've got a cube here, and we'll hit tab to go into edit mode. And if you're in edit mode, I don't know if you know this, if you're in edit mode and you add an object, and we'll add a sphere here, that sphere is now actually part of that object. Even though, you know, I can pull it away here, if we hit tab to get out of edit mode, you can see they are the same object. Uh, and I'm calling this a sub-object. Uh, but like I said, that's probably not the technically the right term. We'll add another object into this object, uh, and we'll just add a cylinder. And we'll grab that over here. So you can see, once again, they're all one object, uh, but different objects within that object. And um, if you select a vertice or vertex from uh, one of these objects by right clicking, you can hit the control and plus symbol. And what this does is it will add to your selection any vertices that are next to a vertice that is selected. So you can see it growing around. I can hit the control and the minus button on the number pad to subtract back from there. Also, if you select two vertices, you can hit control plus and you can see it grows from both of them. And if you see, if, if I hit control plus, I keep hitting it, it never selects the other objects because they're not, those vertices aren't connected to that sub object. Um, so if I needed to come back here and move the cylinder, I can hit, click on it once and hit control plus till I get them all selected, grab it and move it, no problem. That's how I've done it in the past, but I just learned a new little thing. Um, instead of doing that where you could miss some, like if I was to click like this, I could think, oh, they're all selected. Then I go to move it, oh, but they're not. What you can do is just select one and hit control L and it'll select all vertices in that sub-object. So I can click over here, control L, I can click over here and hit control L. I can shift click over here and hit control L and it'll select all of both those and then I can move them out. And that is selecting different vertices or all the vertices of sub-objects. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope that you have a great day. Please visit the links in the description. My website, filmsbychris.com, that's Chris with a K and visit us in our forum and IRC channel as well. All the links are in the description. Have a great day.